Hi guys, thank you for joining. Today we're gonna do very easy, very fun tie-dye napkins that you can later on put into a frame and it creates really cool artwork. I'm gonna use the disinfectant wipes. You can also use baby wipes if you have them and you know what, I think also paper towels that are slightly moist will also work. First, what I want to do is I'm gonna take the wipes. Make sure they're not too watery, so like Get, get the excess moisture out, but it is definitely, it, they definitely need to be moist. Open it up. Now the folding, it's just gonna be in half, and then in half, and then diagonally. To be honest, it's not very crucial how you fold it, as long as there is that center over here, that point, and again in half. So this is our kind of like the center point so that if I am to open up, this will be in the center. Okay. Now this one I'm going to do with my elastics. Best if you have smaller sized elastic. Put this aside. Now the second napkin, I am gonna use a string. So let's again open it up flat, fold it in half. For the thread, I'm hoping the thread will give me more points that I can use and just tie a knot. Okay, so here it is. Here is the one with the thread and here's the one with just elastics. So for the elastic one, I'm gonna use food coloring uh, because, well, simply because I have it and I wanna see how it goes. And for this one that has a lot of colors, I'm gonna use watercolor, but I'll just need to dilute it with a lot of water. So let's see how this, hap how this happens. Lots of water so that it soaks in the color. So here it is, the gradient rainbow, and this one is my food coloring, very simple one. I'm going to let it dry. So uh, these are still a little bit wet, they're definitely not uh, really, really wet, they're kind of in between dry and wet. So I decided that I should open them now because I'm afraid later on when they're dry, they will not... Um, They'll just take the shape of this cone, and I don't want that, so... Oh, this is so fun! I love it! Yes, for sure, this is the time to take it out and put it flat, so that it will iron itself out. Here we go. Ah! So pretty! Love it! Oh, I love the pattern that it creates. So let this dry and we'll see how this looks when it's in a frame. If you like this video and want to see more of videos such as this, please follow, like, and share. Thank you so much. Bye.